Welcome to Let's Play The Legendary Starfy! Now, this is indeed a Nintendo DS game, so I'm going to have some fun switching the camera around. Like this. Now, I own this game on the original con on the actual DS, and it is probably one of my absolute favorite games going. I love this game. And it stars the most manly, adorable star there is, Starfy himself. So, let us get started. Start us a new game. And watch the opening story unfold. Hey there, Starfy, how you doing? And he's a little on the clumsy side, but he's... he's Starfy. Someone crashed through the ceiling, and it's an adorable small bunny person. I think I'd be bewildered too if I just fell through the ceiling. They don't look very nice, do they? No, we can't let them take Bunston! Actually, spoiler, his name is Bunston. We don't know that yet. Let's go, Starfy! A whirling, swirling attack. He's Starfy is quite famous for his star spin. Hey, it's Mo! Good old Mo. Now, I would like to add that this is actually the probably fifth, I think, Starfy game that's been released, but it's the first one that's been released stateside. So I'll try to be explaining a couple things that happened in the previous games. You don't especially need to know them for this game, but it's nice to know. First of all, Starfy met Mo in the very first Starfy games, and they have been best friends since. Whereas Starfy has saved the world and planet and whatever many a time in the previous games, Mo hasn't. Into the ocean, eh? That's another bit that's quite well known in these in the Starfy games, is that the vast majority of them take place underwater. Much swimming is to be had.
But Starfy wants to go save his... <laughs> save this unknown friend. He's Starfy, it's what he does. Now, since I have to switch back and forth between the top and bottom screens, on occasion you will miss out on something. I'll do my best to conclude as much as physically possible, though. Go, Starfy. Answer these questions. That's a big squid. Now we have control of Starfy! We're underwater now, so we can swim around with that. If we hold down the B button, we can swim even faster! If we hit the Y button, I think it is, you can spin, and that's pretty much your attack. Come back, my small bunny-like space friend! Now you'll see currents in the water that let you go a lot quicker. No, he got away! When you see the door, the use button would be the X button. Hi. It's the mermaid, isn't she adorable? Yes, we are THE legendary Starfy who have saved this planet many a time. The mermaid gossip feature has been added to the touch screen. Now, on the top screen is where Starfy is. On the bottom screen, though, is one of a number of screens that you can toggle between. You get them as the game goes on. Right now, we only have mermaid gossip, which tends to be the one I like to leave it on anyway, because the mermaid is adorable. See? There it is. Now if we go in front of this shell and press the X button, we save! And then we move on with our lives! Oh, nothing to do up there. Now these things, there's usually something hiding behind. You can grab it if you swim behind it. If you spin, you just knock the leaf over. And you can see it with your own eyes. And when you get these pearls, Starfy repl- Five tiny ones or one big one replenishes a unit of life. These pearls are everywhere, so you generally don't have to worry too much about running out of life. More pearls. Anything back here? Nope. Treasure! Moe's Diary. Now there's treasures hidden in every stage, and a number of things can be found in each one. A lot of them are journal entries, so you can do this and read Moe's Diary, which is the first one we've unlocked here. Now, the pearls actually have a secondary use as well! Whoop. Hey, Moe! Yeah, like we're heading back to Puff Top now, we've got some stuff to do! Oh, hey, what's this nifty-looking crystal movement? Now, this is the end of the level. Once you find this, you can jump on it and end the adventure! <laughs> and with that, we've finished the first stage! Now, this is generally the world-ish map. The stage map, I guess you could say. Now, up top it says what level you're on, and down below we have where Starfy is. So we go right to the next level, the Star Spin. We will pick up there next time, though, since we're just about out of time. Until then, so long, everyone.